Well, hello there, YouTube. This is uh, day two of St. George. We are now actually uh, leaving St. George and heading to uh, some cabins that Triple X Deadhead got set up for us. And uh, that's just outside of Tropic, Utah. So we're technically leaving St. George this morning. And Lord, <laughs> that was Triple X. He actually startled me. I thought he was a ways back. But we're off to adventures. Man, we had an awesome day going through Zion and uh, continued on past Zion to uh, Kanab, I think was the name of the town. This western town, they used to film all kinds of uh, uh, westerns and stuff out there. And on the walls there's pictures of old western movie stars and whatnot. And we were all, uh, we're all sitting there discussing, wonder, you know, John Wayne, Clint Eastwood, and some of these other famous people drove down that road and sat in that restaurant. You can tell this restaurant's been there for a while. Oh, it's fantastic. This is Kolob Canyon. It's a cool thing that uh, Triple X came across. Yeah, find a tap on the helmet or something, you know. Okay. Okay, so pay attention to the sheriff sitting here to the left. We're actually supposed to go inside. So we're actually doing a, a group vlog. I'm just kind of tagging on to uh, Triple X's group vlog between the three of us here. We were supposed to go inside yeah, the visitor center. Yeah, I'm just going to let it run in the background. So if I repeat things we say, it's just... <laughs> Before I, I know. I, <laughs> I bet you when I look back at uh, Zion, I, it's probably all you're going to hear is, Oh, wow, that's awesome. Oh, wow. Whoo. <laughs> talking about doing group vlogs yeah. and you guys not hearing the other end of the conversations going on. Sheriff, back in the parking lot. And of course I buried mine and I couldn't find it for a bit. So I was the one odd man out. I must have been tired and I, I actually put it in a very convenient place. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, actually the temperature's not bad here. Yesterday in St. George it was crazy. Yeah. Ah, score. Well, it looks like it's a short road, yeah? Two more miles up the road. This is the observation. We're going to go, yeah, there's a little bit up the end. Let's see, we're going to go up five, six hundred more feet. So you get a good view. You can't oh. tell from here, but once you get up, you're going to go up this way and then up and around again. And then you get to see forever. It's just wide open. Oh, wow. Okay, cool. So don't take pictures here. No, no. <laughs> Looking up at one of the highest points in the entire park there. It's more impressive up top. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, fellas, go. Thank you. Thanks. 
love these beautiful red roads so impressive up there oh man just like that officer said you kind of pop around this corner and whoa there it is oh yeah I know I'll harp on this but it's just terrible yeah I know how the GoPro doesn't reveal the scale and beauty of this yeah <laughs> Cloud being cast on those mountains, kind of yeah. disguising it a little bit. <laughs> these guys are always cutting up. That's why I'm always laughing and carrying on. There, wish you guys could hear the, all the conversation. It was kind of funny. Fantastic, actually. I won't be doing this without a GP10 the next time. That's the uh, Cena backpack for the GoPro. I hope this comes across on camera in anywhere close to what it looks like. around at the top, it's just a big turnaround at the top and it's coming down for a photo op on one of the turnouts that we see as we're coming up. We're all like a bunch of rookies trying to trying to park our bikes, get them the right distance away from each other. <laughs> My own bag scared me. I thought somebody was sneaking behind me. I thought one of the guys was scooting by. Are we good? Yeah, no. That's insanely cool. So we jumped back on I-15 and just blasted up north oh, geez, to Cedar is. City. That's and, uh, all right. Went up the canyon. We're uh, yeah, gonna we stop at, at a well, Cedar Break one more time. Around. It's kind of cute, Gabe actually. And, uh, Don't look at the motorcycle people. Wanted to yeah. see this. That was Plus awesome. Plus, it was a route to a, a cabin that. Look at the boy, the little boys over here. They're not paying attention to the scenery. They're just looking at all the Brett's in-laws have, which we'll go to next. Yeah, I, I followed you right into the same hole there.
Yeah. yeah. Like the twentieth time I've been up that canyon, and it's still fun. All right. Let's go down. Oh, we don't bite. <laughs> 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 How am I doing, Bubba? Um, your lens is clear. You got a little smudge, but it, you're probably not going to see it. Yeah. Here. This is going to wig out your. Sean's just going to wipe your YouTube off real quick. Yeah, it's actually sticky. If you could, we need a. Yeah, we need something wet. See if I can get some spit up on there. Oh, no, here. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Come on. Hey, that'll work. Hydration packs. Good for smearing bugs off your GoPro. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> well, they just can't put anything pretty in this state, huh? <laughs> <laughs> wow. That is very, very cool. I kind of like to wrap it. Wow. That's impressive. It just goes on and on. What a view. So is that Cedar uh, Cedar City? Yeah. yeah. Cedar, Cedar Springs? Cedar City. Cedar City. Very cool. The skies, man. No pollution. I'm just not used to that. <laughs> way better up here, too. Very cool. That was all sideways that time. Yeah, that was weird. I was kind of half expecting it to be like all loopy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I wonder if the mic's picking that up. The wind is whistling through my shield and I it gives you that. I really do want to do that. I that one time right in the space. Close up my visor. Maybe that'll help you. I might just use the ribbon. If the shine smells bright. Oh, it's, yeah. <laughs> Gotta have that in there. Good guys, and that's when Sean smells good. <laughs> <laughs> he was just I am your father. So we could hit that up May tomorrow or something if we really wanted it the day after, whatever. Yeah, look at it, yeah, yeah. Well, Gabe and I could go hit it up. Yeah, so you guys could hit it on your way back. If we go do Bryce Canyon, depending on a couple more things, and if we don't get hit, what not? You guys could hit it on your way back and just go down and cross. Oh, okay. I'm done with whatever. We know how it sounds fine, but... Nah, there's no need for that. Well, it kind of sounds like it's better if I have a, if I have a dirt bike. Yeah, yep. Yeah, it's awesome if you have a dirt bike. Which I forgot to bring mine with me. Couldn't pack it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and I don't have one. That also is kind of put the cramp on things. What's funny is we could have all flown over to Sean's smoke house and just gone a big group right from here to his house in his garage. <laughs> <laughs> well, you wouldn't want to experience that first day, though. It's pretty boring. 
I got dibs on anything other than the iron. <laughs> <laughs> I'll ride the venture. Yeah, that's that's probably the most comfortable by far. It's just uh you know, thirty one years old. I nothing's broken yet, but something's got to. It only has like yeah, sixty two thousand or something on it. Next best thing. Yeah. You definitely would be hating life down here on that iron. Oh yeah. If I didn't do something very comfortable with that seat. Yeah, that long, long freeway droning hour after hour. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Very cool. Oh, so, once again, we hit dirt on the Harleys, or the cruisers, I guess we should say. There's Kawasaki in a bunch. But, uh, anyway, this is heading out to Brett Stripholtz Brothers in-laws cabin so Gabe could watch the game so this was Gabe's birthday he's really big into uh, soccer this was the world final or uh, I'm, I don't know that much about soccer but they uh, have a nice TV in their air-conditioned cabin so uh, on his birthday we stopped by there so he could uh, watch the game his team won too which was fantastic all the neighbors are going, the evil motorcycle people just showed up. What? I'd almost want to get in a fight with the wife just to have a plate. Like, come out the other day, we'll have an excuse to come out here. No kidding. Yeah, yeah you put those books now. All right, I'll get you to the cabin. Oh yeah, I've been getting... Oh man! Yeah, it was a big one I tried to dodge. <laughs> Blam! When you actually have a chance to dodge it, you know it's a big bug. <laughs> well, hello there YouTube. This is uh, day two, actually, for me, day four of the adventure. Three. Four. Day four. This is where we're going to spend the next couple days or so. That's our cabins. There's Strip Bolt and Gabe adjusting handlebars. Dave is inside doing paperwork for the rooms. Oh, it looks like there's something on top of that maybe it's just a rock structure but wow is this cool I mean literally just sitting down in this canyon this is crazy this will be wild I mean we are in the middle of nowhere right in the middle of a national park Oh, you must be talking about Mustang seats, huh? <laughs> All right. We are all about to drive, to drive into town dirty here. So before you guys all flame us, it's just a few miles down the road, a little town. We're all taking it easy. Gabe and Triple X had never, uh, you know, they've always lived in California and never experienced uh, not having to wear helmets. I'm old X enough, I remember before you had, it was the law. But uh, as you see, we're, we're just taking it easy, having fun. Mike didn't work so well. I had a head strap and a 
Sony stereo oh, mic and a clip to my shirt. Triplex found this place. What a find. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Right here? Yeah. yeah. Don't touch it. Okay, go ahead and sit down. And just, uh, actually, just stay where you are. Don't walk around too much. Don't put any pressure on it. Ah, fuck. Dude, I'm gonna go back and get the... I think it's the phone right now. Almost. I'm gonna go back and get the kit. I, I, I have a fucking hole, dude. We need to get something. We have a shirt, a rag, or anything that we can tie around. If you do something stupid, this is what happens. <laughs> is it bleeding? Yeah. Anything up here? No. No, no, no. Where do you keep your phone, Gabe? I got a phone. Uh, Give me a second. I'll... I think, yeah. Try to keep your arm elevated if possible. If not, don't worry about it. No, I can't. I can't. Throw. Fuck, man. I'm sorry, dude. It's my fault. Dude. Shit, no service it's still. It's my fucking fault. <sighs> Fuck. Oh, man. Fuck, fuck. Why did I fucking do that? Okay. See if you can get cell reception. All right. And uh, we're on the way to Kodachrome. Okay. No drink. Um, try to find, get him comfortable. Try to prop his head up with whatever you can find to prop his head up. Here's a towel. There's a towel. All right. I threw his glasses in there. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Let's get you. So hey, listen. Listen. I need. Uh, oh man. I need one You're of cool, you guys though. to get on. Just one of you to get on your bike and ah. carefully ride down. Take your time. Relax. Stay calm. Okay. I need one of you guys to go down there, and we need to find cell service. We need to call 911, and we need to get an ambulance out here. All right. Bye, right, Gabe. You want an ambulance? Here. Put this behind your head. Yeah, dude. You well, going? I don't know. I mean, there, I don't see any other way. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we got it. Yeah, we got to do that. I'll, I'll, I'll drive I'll go. in. I'm going to go to the, ho the cabin. Yep. He's gonna go back. They got a phone. They can yeah. That bike went a long ways. Yeah, it did. Are you gonna? Because it'd probably be faster for them to make a call from the visitor center than to drive all the way back. I was just thinking somewhere to get the cell reception because they might. I mean, they probably have a landline, I'm sure. But all right. Well, two calls isn't gonna hurt. So we had all come to a stop.
we're checking by this little cabin we're checking for cell service um gabe was feeling a little spirited and just goofing off a little bit there and basically at a standstill we think uh i think he got tangled up in this cramp buster those throttle extensions bike just got a great big handful of throttle and leaped out from underneath him ghost road for about 150 feet but uh gabe's gonna be okay head surgery um he's gonna be fine all it's all gonna work out okay